I'm Bill from Iron Will, and I want to explain why you should use impact collars. I developed impact collars several years ago when I was testing broadhead blade materials, ferrule materials for hard impacts on bone. I was often damaging arrows. I tested a lot of different half outs and outserts, and I found with that additional lever arm out there, they were very easy to bend on hard impact, especially when you had a side impact at all on the broadhead. I prefer to use hit inserts because then the broadhead shank aligns directly to the ID of the arrow shaft. And if you spin the arrow, you can really see if the broadhead has been bent or stayed straight after an impact. The problem I saw there is I was often damaging the tip of the end of the arrow. I then designed and built these impact collars that overlap the hit insert. And I found on impact now, it's supporting it from a side impact, so it's not damaging the arrow. Without the impact collar, a direct hit would push the broadhead back into the end of the arrow, smashing it in slightly, and repeated hits would then begin to damage the arrow and cause run out of the broadhead. Adding this impact collar with a flange that went over the end of the arrow protected the arrow from those direct impacts as well. Other companies are now making rings or short collars that don't overlap the hit insert. Those don't do nearly as good of a job of protecting the arrow on impacts. A hit insert sits in the arrow 0.45 inches from the end. Our titanium collar is 0.7 inches. Our steel collar is one inch. They both have sufficient overlap for that reinforcement to add the strength needed. You can get additional strength by bonding that impact collar onto the arrow itself. That gives extra reinforcement upon that impact, especially on a straightforward impact. When this collar is bonded and the hit inserts bonded inside and they overlap, you really have a solid metal connection on that front impact. Again, these impact collars were developed specifically to avoid damage on arrows when you had hard bone impacts. Give them a try, I think you'll be impressed.